Alright folks, welcome back to Let's Play Romance 3 Kingdoms 10. I'm the Mysterious JG. Don't know how many videos we're into this thing. 20 something, 30 maybe. But we're about to take Wudu. We've taken over more than half of China. Certainly things are on the pace to be a lot faster than RTK 11 was. Let's keep going. Yeah, we'll be the battle. Should be a layup. This should be easy. Yeah, they've got less than 50,000 troops left. So we should have them out in them. Yeah, I've got almost that many without my other officers. So we don't have them quite outnumbered two to one, but it's, uh... Who we gotta get rid of? Ah, all of his officers have a unit, too. That Liu, Liu Yan's unit. We've gotta get rid of them. That's it. Yan Yan is finally here. I'm surprised he hasn't been involved earlier than this. But yeah, if we get rid of Liu Yan, we've won. Don't have as big an advantage as I thought we were going to have, though. Oh, that's a gate! I just totally blanked on the fact that there's a gate there. I don't need to come around this way. Okay, well, Zhao Yun's unit didn't need to. Zhou Yu's unit didn't need to come down here, but he can direct units from there. That's fine. Matter of fact, so can Jing Tsai. So we got to finish off Yan Yan as soon as possible. Yan Yan was probably the biggest single, the most difficult officer to defeat. Other than the guy who successfully engineered the uh, ambush on Pang Tong uh, of Liu Liu Zhang, uh, Liu, I can't remember his last name now. Liu Zhang, the guy that uh, Liu Bei defeated to take over its Shu, and this I think Liu Yan is his dad. So the fact the only reason we're fighting Liu Yan instead of Liu Zhang is because Liu Zhang just hasn't died yet, or Liu Yan hasn't died yet. That's it. There's Liu Yan making a nuisance of himself. Probably bigger cavalry units that could be attacking than Sound Ends, but hopefully we will not run out of time. All we've really got to do is corner Liu uh, Yan's unit. He's not going to come out and want to fight us, though. So if he's dumb enough to herp a derp and climb off that wall, we've got him. Otherwise, we've got to just keep breaking through the uh, breaking through the, the walls. When we get to uh, the inside the city battle, if we even have one, it's very difficult for the computer to avoid fighting you. If you really want to fight them, you will get a chance. Meanwhile, we can start picking him off. Oh, I can't actually reach them. Oh, well, soon. Soon, soon. Is this exciting, folks? You'll have to tell me. It is the last gasp of, uh one of the starting forces in the game, so it should be kind of exciting. Get over here and climb this wall, it'd really be an advantage. Talonin is going to be the one to bring the Liu clan to its knees. And since Liu Bei never got to take over Shu, really, this is the closest we're ever going to come to destroying Shu. I know about uh, Nine Inch Nails, Eight Halos, deep, deep loathing for Shu, so this will be, be cool for him.
Might be time for, uh, instead of just ordering uh, town in to do everything, to actually roll up here ourselves. Cool, she can shoot arrows through the walls. <laughs> I guess it's supposed to be the entire gate doesn't even exist anymore. Hey, their morale is going up. They are cheering themselves. That's nice. Somebody just turned into a tower or something. Well, let's get Jinx in here. Oh, an ambush! Curse their petty tricks! Crap. How could Lu, Lu Ling Kui's unit not know they were there, though? No attack. They should have known they were there. They're right next to them. Well, I mean, I know it's foggy, but crap. Oh, well. Looks like Lu Ling Kui, even though she's a ranged unit, she's going to have to muscle her way in here because nobody else can do anything until we take out this guy. is really helping them and not me. Nidia and Halos can't do anything now. This sucks. Cautiously moving here, so we can corner them. Oh, there's nobody up here now. They must be the ones who climbed down and uh, took that position. All right, we'll direct Lu Ling Kui again because nobody else can do anything here. It seems like. Maybe. Oh no, she just needs to back off by one hex, and then Jing Tsai can do it herself. That's what. I, yeah, that's what I should have done a little before. Oops. This is more like it. Crush them! Kill, 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 kill! Man, 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 destroy! And she can still attack. No, don't run out there! Ugh! What the? I knew they were there! Ugh. I thought I was gonna get the chance to click attack. Because of the fog. I don't get it. That's probably my fault somehow. Okay, Mr. Singh, so I finished this, which you would. You suppose this pile of bodies still has some bodies in it? Caution, which is annoying, but it's the only safe way to proceed. Yeah, I should I figured we'd run into them, but at least I'd find out where they were. Oh, that wasn't a good idea at all. Thank you for being our sacrificial lamb there, uh, Sao, uh, Nen. But, that's the unit we've got to kill, and now we know exactly where they are, so that's good. Do 
Why can't they climb down the stairs? Oh well. Ah, uh, sucks. Top hat raptor, hurry up and help us kill, uh... Yeah, hurry up and help us direct Zing Sai to finish this. She's down to less than half strength, though, with her unit. But it's Liu Yan, and he's... Now he's confused, so this will be really good. We can probably duel him if we're lucky. It'd be pretty cool if uh, Zing Tsai can uh, defeat the leader of an enemy force in a duel. Understood. Attack once. He's still confused, so we can... She's got a much higher war than him, if it works. Liu Yan, I finally found you! Fight me if you dare! You're like my sworn uncle's cousin's father. Come back when you're dry behind the ears! Okay, he's not gonna fight Li... Uh, he's not gonna fight, which is a shame. It would've been pretty awesome. If we could get Jing Tsai to take over an enemy country by defeating its lord and master in a duel. Meanwhile, there's a whole bunch of guys that for Liu Yan, I don't know where they are, but they seem to have just been totally removed from the battle. Cool. Yeah, well, I mean, we can see them now, but they just kind of aren't in a very useful position for, uh... Apparently you can't climb that wall, so... Okay. Well, we know that now. Now, will he accept a duel? Come on, face me! I don't have time to be playing with you. Fine, I'll finish you off the old-fashioned way. Push them! I must have sunk really low to be caught by the likes of you. Again, with the capturing of Liu Yan. And the conquest of his entire country. We have captured the enemy commander Liu Yan. Victory is ours. Oh. Yeah, take that motherfucker. Jing Tsai, Kiao Nin, and Lu Lin Kui. Three familiar names. First honors was go to Jing Tsai. You are truly skilled, I'm impressed. Thanks. Second honors go to Master Xiao and truly amazing. Ba ba! I lost to Jing Tsai this time. I'm gonna stab that bitch right in the. That is all, people. Well fought. Wu Yi has been captured, Huang Kuang has been captured, Yan Yan has been captured, Jang Ren has been captured, Liu Kei has been captured, Pang Ji has been captured, Jiang Zhang. Move on. Wow, the whole, his entire freaking officer corps, basically. Including Liu Zhang, we could not possibly care about. He refuses to serve. He is a loyal man indeed. So now I just have to order lots and lots of people out to try to hire officers. Yan Yan will work for us. He is the best of his officers. So that if I had to pick one, I was going to get that would be him. The rest of them will probably join us eventually, but they might end up working for Tsao Tsao, which would suck. Yo, Yan Yan is the only one who's actually going to come to work for us. It looks like. But I felt bad enough for executing Jun Yu, and I did get nemesis enemies for that. Yay, we got Wang Lei. What about Li Tong? He seems like a good officer. Uh, he's not going to join us. Liu Jun. Eh, not outstanding, but not horrible. But he's going to work for us. Zhang Shang. I think he was one of the guys who, like, totally screwed up um, and gave bad advice to uh, Liu Zhang and helped 
you know, Liu Bei take over just by being incompetent, so he's probably not really the great officer anyway. Jing Dao wrong. Jing Dao wrong. Oh, Jing Dao wrong. Called us a coward, whatever. Look at this guy's stats. He's got decent charisma. All the rulers do, but wow. We don't want you anyway. Wonders never cease. He's like, good work, buddy. And Liu Yan's army has been wiped off the face of the earth. Oh, this is Wu Du, not Chang Du. So it's not as big. Yeah, Chang Du, I was thinking about making my new capital, but Wu Du. They. Oh, those assholes. They. No, stop! We're out of food, but. They're coming to attack Wu Du. It's like nobody in it. Oh, those fuckers. So I've got no food. My morale is going to be crap, but hopefully, if I can win the battle quickly, I'll get food from them. Oh, this might be a bad idea, though. Where are they at? They're down here. It kind of sucks that I'm out of food, but... Wait. Who's the enemy? The enemy commander is Zhang Lu. Yeah, we just gotta kill whoever we can because all of, he's got two subunits, so it's not like there's only one unit we can concentrate on and then win the battle. Maybe I should have just let the city go. Let the opportunists take the city and just punish them for it later. But one of the reasons why I'm, I'm generally doing really good damage on the enemy is that uh, I've usually got high morale, but that's not going to be the case here will be at a severe morale disadvantage if this battle drags on. Because we're out of food. It's like they used the best tactic ever. Oh my god, they're gonna attack my shit after I'm trying to go home. I'm trying to head home after a tough battle. Oh, those are crossbows. I need to get rid of them. They're more dangerous. Good. And I'm in like super boat, so I should be able to do this pretty well. Yeah, that's pretty good damage. A group that's out of food. Well, that's how Nin's units probably not in the kind of shape where it needs to be done. They're fighting their entire army by itself. Oh, and they got horse bows. I hate horse bows. I can't even attack these guys. Is there too much of a difference in altitude? Oh, 
All right, sound in. Let's uh, get you to attack six times, and then get out of there. Oh, you don't have enough left to get out. Shit. Apparently moving took more uh, force than attacking did. Or action points. So hopefully Town In doesn't die here. Oh, good. Excellent. Town In got his turn and got the hell out of dodge. Doo -doo. So we should be able to win this battle. It's just a... Uh, It's a little annoying to think that uh, we're going to be out of food and I probably have a bunch of troops defect on the way home. So she can duel him, but nothing else. Crap. If we want to win this quickly, we're going to have to cross the river and take def the fight to them. that fire to them and make them breathe their last would you Top Hat Raptor? Top Hat Raptor has been one of my right hand men in this LP. I haven't really come up with a personality to give him since he's based on a real person. And I'm playing too far ahead really to take advantage of uh, all the great opportunities to um, well, I could try a surprise attack. What? Where do these enemy troops come from? Yeah, that's a good question. How the hell did that happen? Wow, that's worked really well. Probably can't do that too often, though. But yeah, I haven't given him a personality because, uh, you know, I'm playing too far ahead. I haven't read his comments. He hasn't been like... Wow, that worked really well. Good job, Zonin. Can you do that? No, but you could probably order him to do it some more. Oh, well, this is the safer bet. The surprise attacks... My experience has always been they don't work that often, although I always thought Blunder was fairly effective, and it really let me down in a couple of battles, so... Maybe I'm just going about this whole thing all wrong. Yeah, we've been a week now with no food. That probably isn't making my guys very happy. Oh, you can only use surprise attack command in bad weather. Oh, never mind that. get a little closer so other people have a chance to try to get out into boats and attack, but I'm not 100% how the terrain works there. Oh, well, the bad weather's back, which should mean that we can... Uh... I want to get rid of these Zhang Lu uh, subunits in the hopes that we can get rid of Zhang Lu's main unit. Sorry. I think the boats we have now may be immune to the we've lost the rudder thing, but I'm not sure. Yeah. 
surprised that went so well. I thought my morale was shot and my, uh... Was fighting a... Well, it's a much smaller unit. That probably helped. What? Where did the enemy troops come from? Rock! Okay, it only works in, uh, bad weather, but damn, that's pretty damn effective. Sound in is like the sneak attack master. Oh. Okay. Totally failed that time. I need to stop doing that now. I think I may have failed more than once and I just wasn't paying attention. <laughs> that would have sucked. Lady Lady and Queen, kill those bastards. Yes, ma'am. Loop to serve. Surprised that went as well for us as it did. They must either have officers with really bad stats, or they just weren't expecting a fight at all here. And the morale's already shot because they didn't think they were going to have to fight anybody. Now we captured Lu Fu Yeah, I don't think I'm going to be going for that whole surprise attack thing again. Went to the well once too often, as they say. So are these are these subunits of his? No! Well, that is. I've got to get rid of them. I don't care about the officer so much as getting rid of the subunit, because if I get rid of all of his units, the Liu Yan unit, or not Liu Yan, the Zhang Lu units, then I stop having to worry about um, actually winning the battle and defeating everybody. I'll win the battle automatically then. And I do want to win this one fast, because I'm out of food. It is to my advantage to put this one to an end fast. Can't... Ouch. You think you can escape from flames? Well, apparently you can. Well, apparently you can't! Ah! So, so much for what I said about how the current uh, thing doesn't matter anymore because of these boats. You can apparently still lose your ship to the current. And we've won by defeating Zhang Lu personally. Now, hopefully I will get a chance to get back to my freaking city and assign some officers here. Top Hat Raptor, of course. Sound End did some pretty awesome stuff, too. Joe, you didn't really do much. Well, I guess my subunit started doing some stuff at the end. Yep. Yep. Hmm. All right. Let's try to hire this guy. Nope. Release him and let him love again. Okay, now we really need to get home. Because we're out of food. But nice if we got some food for defeating their army, but we didn't. Now we're marching home and completely out of food in the winter. My troops hate me a lot. All right. Got 175 days to take care of Zhang Lu, and uh, if he didn't have it coming before, he certainly does now. We are going to uh, transfer government. We're going to transfer... This city has nobody in it. Jiao Chan's force will be transferred up here because, uh... Currently, this city has, like, no st nobody attacking it. Or, well, she's in a city which now, thanks to my more recent expansions, uh, is no longer uh, on the front lines. All officers in Jiangju will be transferred to Wudu. Proceed. Yes. Of 
means this city no longer has a prefect. Sound in. You're up. You get your own city. This means you'll be in the LP a lot less. But, I mean, hey, you've got your own city. You can turn it into, like, some kind of baby paradise. And Chengdu desperately needs a prefect. It's one of the best cities ever. Top Hat Raptor, you've been a star of this LP so far, buddy. And, uh, although probably as far as you showing up and doing stuff on screen, this will be a demotion. Uh, you are being appointed to be the ruler of the capital city of Shu. Good job. Congratulations. That should make you happy, because I think, um, unless I'm mixing you up with somebody else, I think you're the guy whose YouTube picture is a picture of Liu Bei from Dynasty Warrior 6. But I might be totally wrong there, and if so, apologies. Um... Now, let's see if we can get some good officers for these cities. We'll request some from Sun Tzu. Chengdu is an important city. Sun Tzu should recognize that and let us have some guys who are cool. So how about Falger? Yay! Falger! You get to hang out with uh, Top Hat Raptor. You guys can be buddies. Should have sent you to, to Nine Inch Nails 8 Halos town since you guys could like hang out, comment on each other's videos. be awesome. How about getting history buff over there? No. History buff is like, no, you're asking too much. Uh, Zerfall, I would give up gladly. But history buff, no. How about go away? How about do what I tell you, Sensei? I'm going to have to pull some of these uh, officers out of those cities that aren't on the front line. I like having officers in all the cities just so they can sort of build up a little bit. Revenge Elemental, maybe? I'm gonna have to order transfer. So I'll need at least two officers here. So I'll have to pull them out of places that have four or more. Chi Tong has got more than it needs. Chi Tong has, must have like six. Oh, Chi Tong is a place that is on the front lines now. Jiao Chan just took over, so yeah. Bao Sao Yang, I was enjoying having her down there because she's like a non-man chick. But, um, she's also a created officer, which means her stats are too good for her to be hanging around back in a place like this. Four officers, three officers, four officers. That city that's not highlighted in yellow is one of Sun Tzu's. You've got four now. You've got six. You've got two. So we need more for Chengdu. Sun Xuan is in my... He's one of my officers. All right, well, Sun Xuan. Hey, Xuan. You get to go hang out there along with uh, Pei Yuan Xiao. No, wait. Mai Zha, he's a created officer. I forgot... I'm sorry, Mai Zha. I forgot that you were one of mine until I saw those hundreds. And Mr. Person. Although, Mr. Person's in Cheng Xiao, which apparently doesn't have a lot of officers. So now let's take a look at the layout of our land here. Now we've got Zhao Chan up here with five officers, but they've got no units, so they could be in trouble. I, the, uh, the officers went there. I thought they were going to take their troops with them, but apparently not. Six officers here, five there, five there, four. Sorry, folks, I know this probably isn't very exciting. I want to make sure there's no places like way fewer officers than anywhere else. Three is the lowest right now, and that's one of these cities down here that it really just doesn't matter that much. Oh, is this one of mine now? Well, it's not. No, it's not. It's not one of my district cities, but Dakiao is there. This is one of mine. It's got three officers. Ling Ling was like where I got my start. Cheng Sha's got three. Wu Ling still has four. Here's my capital. It's got eight. But I need eight officers, damn it. It's my capital. And then they stop being my cities to do with as I will. Well, I think we need to, um, if we haven't already inspected it. No, we've already got an inspection of them. They've got 30,000 troops in that city. Ten units, 30 officers. 30,000 troops. Okay. 
how is things going for us d domestically here? Order's still really good. Defense has been shredded, though. I need to get that back up in case uh, Zao tries anything while I'm uh, somewhere else. And, of course, I need to get replacements for the units that got shredded, like uh, Sound Nin's unit. Although, somehow, it's... Strength doesn't seem to be that low. I guess it automatically reinforced somehow when it got back to the city. I don't really know. Nah. All you guys can work on repair. Except for you. You can do something else. You can work on trade, maybe? Yeah, you got a good pull. And hopefully I'll get some warrior... Uh, some warriors will show up and go... Rrr, rrr. That'd be pretty cool. Time to ignore the peasants. Because they just really want to waste my turns with this stuff. If this was like, you had a risk of losing... gold, or but you might gain gold, I might go for it, but it's just like... It, this is it takes 10 period 10 days where you can't do anything else this one I'll go for because there actually is a potential upside it still takes 10 days and it was a failure they always seem to fail for me this one I'll go for for sure I was really hoping that I'd get the warrior one where some dude shows up and just says oh, what are you doing your army I'm super badass and you get to do it and it's pretty cool uh, 32 looks like it's the lowest so far. Yeah. Now it's gonna be one of the three nines. One more, and everyone else should be back from their orders. Oh, I forgot though. I've gotta, I've gotta go out there and uh, start trying to hire some guys because there's a bunch of uh, Liu Yan's officers should be hanging around. So we've got Guan Yin Ping after somebody. Yan Yan, well, Dakota Starkness is gonna do it. Liu Yan himself would be able to hire any of these guys. And Xing Tsai, you, he, he refused to duel you. He must be terrified of you. Go force him to join us. Yes, sir. And uh, Liu Qiu. What a shame. Nobody can hire him. He's just too badass. Everybody else has probably already gone to work for somebody else. Damn it. Order starting to drop. But, we can take care of that right now. Excellent. Oh, it's another deliberation thing came up. Damn it. Deliberate. Yes, the warrior! This is what I was looking for. Free increases in strength. Uh, so this would be the weakest unit left. Excellent news, my lord. Soon Chao is of age has come to join our army. Tai Shi Xiang! And spring is here, and young men's fancies turn to thought of recruitment. They all look like hardened warriors. Sadly, it's not true. It's a new year. Messengers come from Sun Tzu. He says, ooh, I get like an extra 250 compared to what I usually get. Nice. This is wonderful. Please report that I'm very thankful. Assembly is now in session. Let's take a look at how I'm informed. Lu Ling Ki kicked everyone's ass. But as you've probably gathered, a lot of the officers that really did well for this city and my force are no longer in this city, so they don't get any credit. Lu Ling Kui, you kicked uh, Jane Tsai's ass. I know I did. Oh, let's review the state of land. Defense is no longer our top priority. It's time to move on to the world. Gotta capture Yi. They've done their repair work. All good stuff. 
order is still okay, but not great. You can't really do any good there, but you can keep working on the farm. I just want to get a nice, full-strength army, and with... Not... I can't wait too much longer if I want to finish off that last city. Uh, so maybe one more round of commands here, and we got to move. Shinxai has failed. The Corner Stark has failed. Come on, guys. What's that about? Oh, Guan Yin Ping succeeded. I can now learn charge. I'm running out of time to do this, though. Okay, man. We want to finish this. Oh, shoot. We're in trouble. We're not going to have time. We've got a lot of troops, though. Where can we get reinforcements from? Already got them badly outnumbered. 23 here. 40. 6,000. That's not good. 12. I have to ask the sound in to lend a hand. And he refused. Fuck you, sound in. Fuck you. So, oh. Jing Ling is my city, isn't it? Okay. We're not going to do it in time. We're not going to meet the time requirements. We're going to get the snotty message from him saying that please try to conclude your uh, orders on time next time. But can't be helped. I've got to stop recording for right now and um, get something to eat. And um, we also have to hold our city. So this sucks. I suppose I could push on ahead. I mean, it would be the only way we're going to do this in time. Oh, let's see real quick. I just save. Let's just see if we can do this really... What I'll do is, um... I'll, I'll set it for auto, and we'll just see if it, it'll happen fast enough that we win.